What's up, everybody? Welcome to Outlaws of the Old West. Welcome back to Outlaws of the Old West. If you're here on YouTube watching, uh, then you'll know that this was pre-recorded, uh, or not pre-recorded, this was streamed on Twitch, and I took the highlight video and chopped it into probably two or three sections and uploaded it. So if you're seeing this now, uh, be aware there may be one or two more pieces of this coming out. Um, this is for everybody watching later. Uh, for everybody in live chat, what's up guys, how's it going? Welcome to an impromptu Sunday afternoon stream. I uh, had planned on streaming a little bit yesterday, but uh, we hung out with the neighbors all day yesterday, fired up the barbecue, it was a nice warm day yesterday, no bad weather uh, for the first time in a while, so um, nice and warm, about 68 degrees yesterday, so it's a good day, to, good day to fire up the grill and uh, do a little grilling out, we got that done. Um, for everybody on YouTube, if you're liking the series, make sure to leave a like on the video. Let me know in the comments below. I've had a lot of comments on the last one. I know it was two hours long. Um, I did chop it down just a little bit from what it was. I just kind of cut out the beginning uh, of me having to load and reload uh, the game. So, uh, hopefully this time around we should be good just to go here. Uh, let's get to live chat. What's up, everybody? How's it going? Uh, Nick, Bud, Bob, Dark, how are you guys? Hope you guys are doing well. And I know not everybody's going to be able to make it today. You know, it's a weekend. People have things going on, so. Still no clue on the game. Updated everything on my PC. Um, man, I don't I don't know. I don't know what, what the problem would be, to be quite honest. Um, I would maybe try looking at some of the forums and stuff to see if it's, uh, you know, maybe your PC's not handling it well or something. I, I don't know. I don't know what to do. Uh, I don't know how to help you out there, man. <laughs> what do you mean? Like lives? Sucker, see ya, Bob. <laughs> um, for me, man, like, I normally can't stream on the weekends because, oh, not that I can't, I choose not to uh, most of the time. Uh, but if I'm working, I can't stream. Uh, and if I'm home, you know, that's that's about the only time that uh, the old lady isn't working and I'm not streaming anyway, so um, I try to spend some time with them, but they are out of the house. Old lady and the kid went to the movies. She took her to the movie. They went to spend an afternoon together, so uh, I thought to myself, well, why not stream? So here I am, uh, hoping to do this more often when I can, uh, when I am home and I'm not working. Maybe do a, maybe do a couple extra streams. Uh, here and there a month, maybe. Uh, today, I'm going to try to work further on um, some things. That there's something I want to do. I want to build kind of a um, a shop, so to speak, uh, for all of my... Um, for all of my uh, building things uh, and move out to the shop. All of my stuff that I have right now that I can move. Um, I can't, some of it I can't move, I'll have to destroy and just build new ones of, so those I may leave, but I'm going to move as much as I can uh, into a separate building and just make that with my house, uh, I think. And then somebody on YouTube mentioned building fort walls around the base uh, for bandits, so uh, definitely going to look into that too. Uh, so thank you, I can't remember who it was that commented it, but thank you for the comment and giving me a heads up on that. You loving this game? Can't wait? Dude, yeah. I, I can't wait till you, till you get till you get it, man. Like it's it's such a fantastic game. What am I running for Nvidia? Uh, just the latest update. Um, to my graphics card wise, running a 1070 Ti. Uh, I ran out of wood in the last one, is why we're chopping all this. If you if you're watching this on YouTube, I'll probably cut some of that out of me just kind of running around and talking. I'll probably. There'll probably be lots of cuts uh, on this one. I don't think I'm going to do a straight two hours of gameplay. Um, I'll probably just cut and highlight a bunch of this. How much wood did we end up with? Not, not really enough. Uh, not near enough, really. We've got... Uh, <clears throat> Am I going to do a multiplayer on this game? I I'm thinking I am, man. I think I'm going to throw, uh, throw a server up for this. Uh, I have been talking to one great member of our community that's talking about uh, maybe uh, donating toward the server. Um, much appreciated for them. I'm not going to call them out if they want to say who it is. They're more than welcome to. 
Um, but I'm not going to call him out for that because I never did ask if I could or anything like that. But uh, yeah, uh, definitely, definitely going to throw a multiplayer server up. Like I said, man, as soon as subsistence releases to to uh, to be able to server host, I'll put a subsistence server up as well. So we we can have a couple of different servers running, man. I'm good with it. Give everybody a variety of stuff to play. Uh, I mean, after all, it's it's about you guys, man. It's about the community, you know. Like it, it may be me streaming the game, but it's about the community, really. Um, and I think having having multiplayer games is is uh, is key, you know, for for everybody to stay involved. Oh my God, what is the deal? I'm on a single player game. I'm not on a server, and it's like throwing me around everywhere. Weird. I need to catch some more of this wood, though. Uh, we don't have near enough, so. Uh, we'll have to go back and collect some more. Uh, although, everything did spawn back, so apparently there is a uh, uh, kind of jittery at the moment. not real sure why. Um, there was a couple of big updates that came out, so there we go. Refill our water there. And uh, probably actually pick up some more fish. House is there. I think our fish basket's right here. Uh, sensitivity in this game does not change for me for some reason. Not real sure why. Where did our fish basket go? Is it on this point? I think it's on this point. Hate Linux with a passion. Linux is not great for uh, gaming. Last, last I knew. Uh, I mean, I could be wrong, but I had a fish basket out in the water somewhere. It may have, it may have disappeared with the uh, with the update. I'm not sure. You've been playing closed multiplayer? I'm just playing on single player, so... Took forever to get back. Yeah, I think I have a bed made. Um, I'm pretty sure I made a bed. That was one of the last things we did. Trying to change it over to Windows. Ooh, good luck, man. That's a, that's a task in itself. Uh, I just want to finish chopping some wood here before we head back. Oh, dude, yeah. I, I people people go. Oh, you can't use the excuse. It's early access. Why not? Uh, it's not an excuse. It's true. <laughs> it's it's early access, man. I mean, don't expect it to be a perfect game, you know. Uh, but yeah, I do have a bed made. Uh, I was thinking I did. I don't think you can sleep, but uh, set new spawn location. So I don't know how to set the spawn. I'm guessing that sets it. Maybe. I'm not. I'm not 100% positive. Um, I need to figure out what we need to be making though. Somebody mentioned fort walls in the YouTube video, so uh, we're gonna look at maybe making some fort walls, and I have no idea where to start uh, on those. So um, let's go into our crafting first and make sure we've made everything possible that may get us that direction. I got a brick forge. Uh, I have a smoker. Uh, I don't have a metal working uh, bench yet. I don't have a sewing bench. I don't think either. We used to make clothing, so we'll need one of these. I don't think I have one of those. Pretty sure I don't. House is huge. I mean, this is it, though. This is as big as it is. Um, did I move it over to this side? No, I haven't moved anything over here yet. Uh, this is as big as it is. I mean, honestly, it's not It's not too big. I don't think. Uh, actually, you know what? I'm going to leave these bottom ones closed on that side. I'll open this side. Let some light in. And uh, we'll open some of these upstairs too. There we go. Uh, open some of these windows upstairs. It's a little light. Uh, I'm not sure why I closed them. I think I closed them all just to take a look at it. But I like the open shutters. Uh, lots of windows. I know this is very unrealistic. Normally you would not have a house with this many windows. Definitely not a cabin with this many windows. Because well, there's no central heat and air in these things. So uh, typically you would want to keep as much heat or cool air in as you can. Uh, but just for the sake of having light in the building... Uh, we'll do that for now. Uh, definitely, definitely something to consider. Uh. 
Yeah, man, they've definitely they've definitely been updating this thing a whole whole lot. Dot your spawn pointers and set click on the end. You have options. Oh, okay. So you got to hold E, set spawn. So if I hold it down and click it, set new spawn location. Okay, is that it? All right. I, th I think that's it. I think we set our spawn point. I hope we did anyway. Uh, Shorty, thank you for the bits. Much appreciated and welcome. Good to see you. Uh, but yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I'm, I plan on expanding this thing even more. Uh, I thought I had built more things than this. I guess I did not. Uh, so let's go to our crafting real quick. We're going to need a sewing bench. Uh, do we have a table saw? We do have a table saw. Um, we have a table saw. We have uh, a carpentry bench. We have a brick fireplace. We have a brick forge. We have a smoker. We don't have a metal working bench. We don't have a shoe hat bench. Uh, which we don't need one right this second. We do not have a gunsmith table. Um, we don't have a grinder. We don't have a chemistry bench. We don't have a saddle station. We don't have most of this, actually. So, definitely something we're going to think about uh, in, in the very, very near future here. So, let's get a sewing bench made and a uh, whatever else we can do here. Ten planks. Let's see if we can make ten planks real quick. Wait, do I have planks over here? Uh, I do not have planks. Yeah, I do. I do have planks. There we go. Alright, now we have ten planks. We can make, uh, our gunsmith table. How many planks is this? It takes ten glass. Oh, okay. Uh, saddle station we really don't need at the moment. A distillery would be nice to have, I guess, but we don't have to have it. Uh, let's go with the next available thing here, gunsmith table. That's what we have. We need to work toward getting planks and leather and planks and glass. However you get glass, I have no idea. Uh, I wish I did. <laughs> Shorty, thank you for the bits. Kind of waiting on it to get daylight. My chat isn't working. I can't see or type. Hi, everyone. Uh, bad thing is nothing carries over to multiplayer. Uh, tried a public server last night. Made it ten minutes and got shot in the face. Yeah, I don't do multi. I don't do pu public servers. Um, mainly because if you record and and upload videos and stuff, it's not going to work out good for you. So. Uh, windmill, I need 40 planks for that. Uh, I'd like to get a little more established. So what I want to do right now is I want to make me an outbuilding or carpentry work. I want to start kind of making a little town here. Uh, so I want a carpenter's place. I want a blacksmithing place. I want that kind of stuff. So, uh, oh, you know what? No. You know what we need to do first? Let's go finish working on our front porch here. I think this is going to be lots of fun here. Wow, that loading lag is just insane. We jump up there? We can. Okay. Let's go uh, ceiling. Log ceilings. Okay. So we need to go Can I get it to go here? I want it turned that way. There we go. A little porch here. I want to put a side rail. Uh, cheers for the impromptu St. Patrick's Day stream. Yeah, man, absolutely. Oh, today is St. Patty's Day, isn't it? Hope you guys are wearing green. You guys are wearing green. What's up, DJ? How's it going, man? Uh, let's put up uh, a set of stairs here. I think I want a double set. Something like that. And then go uh, a railing here and a railing here. Double set of stairs, railing, railing. Okay, good deal. Uh, and I kind of want to... I kind of want to build out one more on this, but uh, that would get kind of weird, I think. 
Let's do... Uh, let's do this. Let's try this real quick here. Does that look too weird without the post? I think it does. Let's go ahead and let's go ahead and do it. Yeah, let's just go ahead and do this. Uh, that looks kind of weird without the post under it, so. Under walls? No. But under, yes, there we go. Pillar? And pillar? I know it's not the brightest outside, but it's not too bad. <laughs> Bob. Uh, yeah, I think that'll work. I think that'll work. Now let's see if we can move this. Uh, no, all we can do is delete it. It's okay, we'll delete it. It's fine. There we go. And then we'll do this. Not that. This. There. There. And then... Here. Oh god, why? Every time I click something, it like spins me around in a circle. There and there. Cool. Now, we go upstairs. We're gonna make a balcony around this thing. Which, I mean, that's kind of our balcony. We're just gonna go up and put railing around it. Uh, this is something I was kind of looking forward to finishing up uh, in the last one we did here. I just, please don't destroy the wall up there. Oh, he destroyed all of it. Dang it all. All right. Uh, let's see. Let's do a doorway. It's not where I wanted the doorway, but okay. Uh, and then let's do a full wall. <clears throat> oh, the doorway does not work there for some reason. Okay. Uh, wasted wood. It's okay, though. Why doesn't the doorway work there? Do I need to spin it around? That's what it was. I need to spin it around. All right, cool. Now, let's do a full wall. I think it's a full wall. What, what is going on there? Not a full wall. Was it like two half walls or something? Why is there a gap there now? That's weird. Okay. Let's try this. Use two half walls, I guess. How am I destroying things? Hold down E when you're looking at stuff. So like owned by Francis, uh, Francis McGee Killiga, uh, hold down E on the door frame and it'll highlight it and then you can move your mouse on what you want to do. I just canceled, so. Well, let's do the, the railings around here. Why? Why, why is that even down there? Like, how's that even possible right there? I just, I want it right here. There we go. Now, we got us a nice little, uh... Nice little, uh... uh porch here. Now, do we need a roof on this? Because if we do, it's going to be pretty close. So it's going to be like here, right? Yeah, and that's going to look really strange coming off the front of this, I think. So we can try it. We'll see what it does. I think I'm out of wood. Yeah, I'm out of wood. Oh, no, I'm not. Okay. Oh, I got one more. Okay. One more to do. Now, I got our little porch here. Uh, I feel like we need a couple of posts. We probably don't need them all the way down, but we'll need them like here. that go through it? Maybe not. And... One on each side there. And then one down here. We don't need like a hundred of them. Uh, that's probably fine right there. That looks pretty good to me. Let's go outside and see what it looks like. I don't want to jump in case there's uh, damage. Oh, we need a door. Let's build a door real quick. There we go. Perfect. All right, let's put that away for a minute. Ellie Grace Clementine, nice. Yeah, see, this is ridiculous. Now then, 
Now we've got something going. That looks good. I like that. That is not bad. Actually, you know what? Well, I know I need the railing here. I mean, I need the post here so the railing looks correct. So yeah, all the posts on the bottom are going to have to stay on the top. I like it kind of open, though. That doesn't look bad. That actually looks pretty decent. I'm happy with the uh, the progress here. How much wood do we have left? Uh, we have uh, 174 pieces of wood left. All right, good. Uh, we've also got some stuff we need to put down inside here. Uh, but like I said, I think I want to build kind of an outbuilding for a workshop. So let's, uh, let's look at doing that uh, maybe just off to the side here. Uh, so let's go here. Let's go foundations. Let's go... Uh, kind of like, I guess, just right along with it. We're going to try to build a little town here. So... Yeah, I do too, Bob. I do too. That's one of my big appreciations of this game so far is uh, I like that I can do stuff uh, fairly quickly. So I want this thing to be very, very, very large uh, if it's going to be a workshop. But I don't know if I want to make it a workshop. Um, I think I want to make it like different... Uh, make this one a uh, like a clothing shop, for instance. Um, and if we do a multiplayer server for this, uh, I would like to set up kind of roles. So we'll do, you know, somebody's the carpenter, somebody's the, somebody makes clothing, different shops and stuff, and we all have to like kind of barter with each other. That way you're not going out and trying to do everything all at once. I would like to kind of set up kind of a role-playing thing, if you guys would be into that. You have two horses thing about building a barn, that's kind of neat, yeah, Absolutely. Um, and I think I kind of want a porch on this side, too, too to be honest. Uh, a wraparound porch all the way around this thing would be cool. Hmm. That would be kind of neat. As long as you're not the farmer. Hey, man, I'll do the farming. I don't care. Uh, that's pretty close to in line. It's not bad off. Uh, I doubt these things were perfect back in the day anyway. Uh, we need to go one more wider, I think, though. Four back is fine. One, two, three, four. But five wide is what I need because I need to put a doorway right here. And then walls around it. And what we'll do, we'll do this. Put windows in the corners, maybe. Solid walls here. So that's not looking bad. That's pretty good, actually. <laughs> Aphrodite, how's it going? Hope you're doing well. Don't hate me, Bob. <laughs> Bob the Builder. <laughs> yeah, I, know, I figure a lot of people are not going to like a lot of roles. Um, like Hunter Gatherer. You know what I mean? Like you're you're hunting uh, hunting animals, berries, stuff like that. Then you got farmer roll. Then you got somebody that makes hor uh, horseshoes and and stuff like that. And then you got, uh, I mean, th there's all kinds of different stuff you can do in this game. So I think it would be a lot of fun, to be quite honest. Oh, this game is absolutely amazing. Yeah, absolutely amazing. All right, what kind of roof do we want on this now? That's the that's the thing. Uh, I say we do. Um. Log sloped ceiling, logs, log sloped half roof, long gable. I really want to see, I want to do some triangle stuff, actually. Uh, we'll do that on the next building, though. Uh, that's going to be a trial and error thing. Let's see. If we do uh, a log flat roof there. So if we do... Oh, yeah, me too. I love this game. It's fantastic. Let's, let's look at this one. Oh, do I not have enough wood? Am I out of wood again? I'm out of wood again. Alright, well, let's go hunt for wood. Guys, if you're watching this on YouTube later, uh, you're going to miss me harvesting all this wood. 
Sad. Your traps don't work? Oh well. Alright, let's see. Let's go with Bob's. Let's go with Bob's suggestion here. Let's build an upstairs for this place. Um, it's not going to be a huge upstairs. We'll build an upstairs though. Let's see. Do I want to run these? I want to run this way. It'll be like a single room upstairs, right? Uh, let's go, let's go one more. Go back to my hammer. Go one more row. Oh no, not the bow, the hammer. There we go. Alright, now. Um, let's go one more row. Like, I'm just building all square buildings and stuff. There's a... Uh, Needs a support. Okay. There, there's so much more in this game than, than what I've even tackled yet, right? I'm just building square buildings. There's options to do all kinds of different things. Oh, did I have that one turned the wrong way? Dang it. All right. Wasting wood again. Luckily, wood is pretty easily accessible in this game. Uh, so... There. Yeah, I'm going to need a support right down the middle of this, I think. Uh, which is sad because this is the center of the building. Uh, so let's do let's do this. Let's go one here, one there, and then we should be able to put this in. Yeah, there we go. All right, now uh, I want to go one more here. Turn that way. Why? Because I want to put a set of stairs right there. Go up. There we go. Um, everything's turned the right way. Everything looks good. All right, let's let's build some counter space back here, uh, preferably using some half wall stuff. Uh, I think if I do this, right? We got our little counter back here. We can't really make a counter top though. I don't think. Um, I don't think. What does this look like? Doesn't really attach anywhere, does it? Uh, I guess it's got to be on top of a regular wall. That kind of sucks, though, because I'd like to put like a countertop type thing on this. Um, dang. All right. Well, never mind then. <laughs> I kind of wanted to do that, but uh, let's put some more walls in up here. I'm going to do walls uh, on three sides here and do a few minimal windows. Alright. Do that. There we go. And then, we want to put a doorway right here. Uh, and walls straight across. For the privacy of the person renting this room here. Pretty nice size room, to be honest. That's not too bad, really. We could really do two rooms right here. So we could do a hallway. And then just have, like, a 4x4 four four as a room. Right? That might be cool. We catch up with chat real quick here. Alright, I want to see how this looks. Let's do this. Let's build... Uh, build a wall right here. Uh, if it'll let me. Yeah, right there. And then... A wall there. Which means I'm going to have to go back and put an extra window in the room. I guess I don't either. I don't have to do anything. It'll have one window in the room. Come on. Right there. Nope. That was the wrong place. There we go. Let's take this back down. There we go. 
Build a wall here. We can do two rooms up here. Oh, I'm out of wood again? Yep, I'm out of wood again. Okay, let's go make another axe. So you see what I'm doing here. We'll put a solid wall, doorway, solid wall, doorway. And then have the rest of this is just a hallway. And I'll have two rooms up here I can rent out. What you guys think? Yeah? Yeah? I like the idea of it. Uh, what time is it? 440. We're going on food and stuff. Let's go chop down. Oh, no, I need uh, I need an axe before I go chop down trees. Uh, so what I'm thinking is, oh, I need a window. Oh, I've got a window here. Oh, the stairs look really funny coming through the window. I may fix that at some point. All right, we need to make a... Uh, what do I need for this? Wood. Oh, perfect. I need 10 wood. Let's see if I have any in here. I think I got it all out the last time I did. All right, let's let's uh, let's put some of this stuff down here while we're standing here. Uh, three. What is this again? Is this a sewing machine? Um, I think I might... I think I might move this over there. We'll make this our first shop. Uh, something else I'm going to do on this building. Uh, I'm probably going to make a semi-flat roof or a small angled roof, but I'm going to do like the... Uh, um, what is that? Is that lightning? Is that new? I don't remember the thunderstorm that I was first in being this bad. Holy snikies, man. Alright, so this is the sewing machine that I want. Right there. Alright, and what is this thing again? I cannot remember what this does. This is a gunsmith table. Alright, yeah, we'll put the gunsmith table over here for now. Oh man, look at the rain! The lightning, look at the rain, you can see the rain, guys. Holy crap, this is cool. My goodness. You can actually see the rain coming down out of the clouds. Oh man, that's awesome. That is really cool. Really neat stuff. Alright, can I move this? I can, okay. So this guy, I want to move over here. I don't know if I'll be able to, though. It's raining in your house? Oh, that's not good. You get your roof mate. Alright. So it doesn't look like I'm going to be able to move this thing over here. I'm going to have to delete it and build another one, I feel like. Uh, I need to go chop some more wood, though. Or collect some more wood so I can make an axe. Yeah, so, guys, for the community, we will be putting up a, uh, a multiplayer server for this. Uh, apparently, there's a lot of interest in it. You guys all seem to really like it. So we're definitely going to be doing that. Uh, I will also have a series on that multiplayer. Because uh, I'm not going to do a single player and a multiplayer unless this unless this doesn't get wiped and I can continue playing on this one. Because I've already got it quite a lot done and I kind of want to keep it going. Because I have some ideas that I want to do. So, is this like Rust? Um... The last time I played Rust was, like, four years ago. Um, and Rust is a survival game like every other survival game. you got to collect materials. So as far as I'm concerned, it's a survival game, yes. Is it like Rust? No. Um, it's a survival game where you got to collect materials and build things, yes. Um, but you can tame horses and uh, build some really cool Old West-style structures. Uh, log cabin style, fishing, hunting, the whole nine yards. Uh, will it be PvP? No. The the community will not be PvP. It will be PvE. Alright, Shorty. I appreciate you coming by, as always. Thank you for hanging out. Uh, but yeah, I don't do PvP because mainly uh, I don't want my stuff getting destroyed. And if I stream and record it, then I can't go hide out in the middle of the woods somewhere. You know what I mean? I'd rather it be like an RP style. Uh, now, if you guys want to do, you know, like gun duels or whatever, the fastest draw, you're more than welcome. Uh, that might be fun to do, but as far as like PvP is in raiding people's bases and stuff, no. Absolutely not. Um, I, I have several different games that I play, so it, on, for my end, it's, it's way too time consuming to have to rebuild just because, it, you know, it's a PvP server and... I've got stuff built on there, and I'm not really participating in the PvP, but then I log back in, and my stuff's gone. You know, like that, for me, that would be a good reason for me to stop playing and just do single player. So, uh, I mean, if you want a PvP, there's plenty of, of public servers out there. I'd rather do like a role-playing type PvP. 
or PVE rather. I mean, it, like I said, it can be a PVP in a uh, in a setting where you know uh, high noon. You meet at high noon and and the quickest draw or whatever kind of thing. That'd be kind of fun to watch. But uh, I think as far as um, just open PVP, yeah, yeah, I'm with you. I don't I don't really like PVP so much. So you spend all your time grinding to work towards something and you're playing with like four people and a group of 25 people uh, come over and take all your stuff. It's like, yeah, okay, man. You know, because you have more people playing with you, you're able to do that. Uh, it's fair because you're on a PvP server. I get that. But at the same time, for me, it's like, uh, I, don't, I don't do PvP. So... Uh, um, I've yet to figure out the respawn rate of things. Um, so... That if somebody has any info on the respawn rate, you know, throw it up in chat. I would love to know. Or if you're watching later, uh, leave a comment down below. If you're watching this on YouTube. Yeesh. There we go. Because uh, I really love, would love to know the, the respawn rate of things. Because it feels like, you know, once you chop all the trees down, they're kind of gone. Yeah, that's true. That is very true. Animals would definitely be uh, be one of the things you'd have to keep an eye out for. Basically, log in every day, kind of thing. Um, I hope there's a setting to where you can set it to where if nobody's online, then it doesn't run, kind of thing. You know. Uh, but auto feeding is definitely going to be a necessity um, if you're. Uh, I need to go ahead and make another one of these, I guess. Um, and we need to make a metalworking station. Where's it at? A chemistry bench. Battle station. Where's the metalworking station at? Is that it? No. That one? Metalworking bench. There we go. Alright, so we got that. We'll just leave that in there. Uh, for future, future days. Metal spear. That'd be kind of neat to have. Tool used to build plank structures. I'm going to say that we're going to need this to build uh, walls around the fort, if I had to guess. Fishing pole. I still would like to craft a fishing pole and try it out. I just don't know what I need for bait. Do you have to have bait at all? Bunk beds. That's kind of neat. Um, so we got our metal working bench. Let's put it down somewhere. Uh, let's just start it over here. Don't know which way it needs to be though. Probably like this. Go ahead and open those up. Uh, what can we build in here now? Looks like an ice axe. That's kind of neat. A tool to collect ice. That's kind of weird, but okay. A sickle for gathering plants. Throwing knife, a tier three throwing knife. That's pretty sweet. Uh, candles, yeah. A standing candle that can be placed on the ground. Okay. We need beeswax for that though, so we need to build a beehive. Uh, and those are here, All right? Yeah, there we go. Uh, we need five planks to do that. We can do that, no problem. Let's go get some planks started. I do, man. Yeah, I do actually. do this the easy way. Uh, let's make uh, 40 planks if we can. Alright, that still left us enough wood to get building again, so that's good. Uh, I just like how big the inventory is, and it and you have a weight limit. Uh, oh, we have $44 in cash. Cash is an actual currency on here, so we may not have to do a barter system. Where would you find ice? That's a good question. Uh, I don't know about seasons or biomes, but I know up in the mountains up there, there is ice up there. Right? There about has to be ice up there. Uh, and this world is pretty massive, as far as I know. Uh, so a horse is a necessity uh, for getting places, as far as I'm concerned. So we're going we're gonna to look at getting a horse pretty soon. Uh, maybe, not, maybe not right this second, but definitely, definitely in the next stream we're going to try to try for a horse. There are four biomes on the map, right now anyway. It's still early access, so there's four up, four biomes. That's cool to know. 
Standing candles can only go outside. Okay, we might put them out on the porch then. That'd be kind of neat to have. Alright, let's go over here. Oh no, we need a beehive, don't we? Let's get a beehive going. Uh, let's see. Maybe right out back here. Be a good place for one. You know what? I kind of want to do them away from the house. Let's do them over here somewhere. With the rest of our stuff. This is a pretty flat area too. Oh great. It's raining. Good. Almost done. There it is. Alright. Let's do a beehive. Let's do them kind of over here too. There we go. Alright, so I guess in time we will have loot in there. Uh, also, we leveled up. Uh, we have four skill points we can set. So let's do health, uh, weight, combat, and thirst. Thirst seems to be one we run out of quite a bit. So let's do that. Uh, what size is the map? I have no idea. Um, you can see the little bit of area I've explored here. Uh, I don't know, my X is 1,362,627, my Y is 1,166,617. So, uh, this is the area I've explored here, just this little bit. Um, and that's about as far as I can see in the plains area, I think. So, I have explored very little of this map, apparently. Uh, very good question though um, I, I don't know a whole lot about the game I wish I knew more about it I'm working on that I'm working on learning more about it uh, so forgive me if I don't if I don't have uh, all of the answers right away I get the beehive going we're gonna need some uh, Patch broke the game, you can't craft anything. Uh, try um, initializing your files or whatever it is. Uh, not initializing, that'd be bad. Um, uh, God, what's it called? What's the thing called? Uh, a larger two-handed axe for harvesting wood. That's the one we want. And then the same thing for the pickaxe. And then a scythe harvesting plants. Um, shears to collect wool, metal bucket for carrying water, anything else, uh, storage box two, storage box made out of wood planks, okay, uh, verifying files, yeah, verify the files, there you go, try verifying the files, dark, see if that helps, uh, a shovel, digging in the dirt, I want to make a shovel, I don't know why, I just want to make a shovel, who used to build brick structures, was that a lay? Uh, not a lathe. Uh, what's it called? A thing to build brick structures? A metal mailbox, that's cool. We're gonna go from log cabin town to brick structures. Uh, and, and that's really neat to me. That's a cool, uh, metal trough. High capacity metal trough that can be used to automatically give water or food to livestock. See, that's important. That's very important. Well pump. That's kinda neat. Uh, small safe. Uh, is that a pipe wrench? To build plumbing structures. What? A uh, metal canteen. A water canteen is something we probably need. And we have plenty of iron. Let's go ahead and build one. Uh, ceiling lantern. Uh, wall lantern. We'll build one of each. I just want to see what they look like. A lot of the stuff I'm just building because I have the material right now. I don't want to see what they look like. So what is this down here? Uh, a lantern. Oh, a street lamp. Look at the street lamps, man. That's cool. All right, good deal. Oil pump. Uh, man, there's so much in this game, and we ain't even scratched the surface. We have not even scratched the surface. What is this? A sledgehammer used to demolish structures and get the resources back. That's what we need. Uh, tool used to build refined wood structures. Okay, so several different hammers. 
Uh, I'm about to replace that guy right now. What was this one? A shovel. I want to find out what the shovel does right this second. Uh, and there's my lantern. There's my canteen I need. And there's my ceiling lantern. So let's do this. Let's, uh... Oh, I didn't get the ceiling lantern. Dang it. All right. Uh, ceiling lantern. Let's put it over here. Now, uh, let's see what the ceiling lantern looks like. We don't have any light in this other one, and I've got torches in here, so that'll work for now. Uh, this will be our primitive shelter as, as, as for now, anyway. Uh, let's see. Let's do a ceiling lamp uh, right in the center here. That's pretty neat. Oh, look at the shadow it gives off. It's really cool. There we go. Alright, now a wall lantern. Let's see what it looks like. That's cool. Alright. Very neat stuff there. Uh, I like the lanterns versus the torches. Uh, very cool. Very cool stuff. Alright, let me do this. Let's go put our axe up. And take our two-handed axe. Actually, you know what? I'm going to take them both. I'm going to take them both. Uh, we're still going to need to gather more wood, but I have a bunch of stuff I really need to drop off. So we don't die with it on us. Um, what is that? Spoiled item, of course. Uh, we'll keep our torch on us. Cooked fish. Uh, I think it's the fish that's spoiling, probably. Uh, slingshot can go. I've got arrows and stuff. Bricks can stay. Aloe, stone. Uh, fibers can stay, because we'll make rope when we get back. Uh, oh, look, more fish. Oh, that's cooked and smoked. That's the difference. Okay. All this can stay. Is that coal? Yeah, that can stay. Stone can stay. So all this stuff. I need the arrows. Iron, wood, hammer can stay. Canteen's going with me. And then all this stuff's going with me. Planks can go. All right. Uh, shovel. Let's put the shovel down. Oh, shovel's in four already. Let's put our bow uh, in three. There we go. In case we get in a fight with anybody. Uh, close our doors. Just just in case. I know they could probably break in anyway, but we haven't been this way, so we're going to head off this way and go, go find some stuff. Uh, oh, look at that. Already. Three honey and one beeswax. Cool. Alright, let's go search for some wood. We'll see if we get more wood out of the, uh, out of the big axe or the hatchet. I'm going to say we get more out of the big axe. That's just me. Uh, let's do that, and let's do this real quick. That got weird. Hit two buttons at the same time, that's what you get out of it. Okay. Uh, so apparently you can only dig in certain dirt, I guess. Hmm. Nope, that's a weapon. <laughs> Alright, good to know. Alright, similar style trees. Let's go with this. Similar style tree here and there. Weird. Uh, I had uh, very few pieces of wood on me when we started. I think I picked up two on the way. Let's say uh, we got 15 out of that. All right, now let's try the two-handed axe. Let's see what happens. See if we get more wood here. Thirty-two. So we got almost double what we already had out of that. I think you get more using the two-handed. Looks like I'm getting two at a time there instead of one at a time. I mean, it only makes sense though, right? It's only fair. spent more more um, resources building this one than you did the smaller one so I feel like it only makes sense to get more out of it beehive is knocking out some wax that's good uh, but yeah this is gonna be kind of a uh, uh, this is like a clothing shop there's gonna be two rooms above it to rent out uh, of course all this is just kind of make-believe in my mind but uh, you know you know what I'm doing you see what I'm going with this all right, we got plenty more wood. Um, what else can we make here that is going to be necessary? 
let's look at this thing. What do we need here? We can make yarn from cotton, okay? And we can make uh, fabric from wool, which we don't have any sheep. Make canvas from hemp. Sleeping bag. A lasso. We need 10 rope. Wait, what was that last thing? A mobile building for respawning. A tent. Okay. Uh, we need rope. Let's make a lasso. I know I have rope somewhere. Yeah, I've got 48 rope. i got more than enough for that. There we go. Lasso! About to catch us a horse. I said in the next stream, but I changed my mind. I'm going to go ahead and do it. <laughs> Dig other miners' claims. There you go. <laughs> Bees! I know, man. It's awesome to have honey and stuff like that. That's kind of neat. All right, got ourselves a lasso. Let's uh, let's put that there. Oh, uh, I forgot. I got to put it in my inventory first. There we go. And then go here. Where did it go now? There it is. Put it in slot number four. Oh yeah. There she is. Let's go see if we can catch this horse now. Woo! 